Hello YouTube, welcome back. Early day at work, decided, you know what? It's time to make a cocktail. So we're gonna do a simple one. Let's set up our uh, handy dandy video recording device here, AKA cell phone, cause I'm a cheap motherfucker. So what we got here, we're gonna do a whiskey sour. Very simple, cocktail mix, pretty good. Basically, lemon juice, sugar, and water. And we're gonna finish off the Bib and Tucker. Uh, if you want to see a review of that, you can look up my next video. I'm not no master mixologist. I usually go about two fingers. And look at that. Fuck it. It's the end of that. So there's that. And we're going to do our mix. I know a lot of people do the whole shaker, you know, the fuck that. That is goddamn stupid because, hey, I don't put ice in my drinks. I think that's retarded. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use a fork. I'm going to do a little mixy, 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 stirry, stirry, stirry. reason why I don't do ice, very simple. Why I don't do ice. Ice is frozen water. You need your spirits watered down, do you, guy? Well, maybe you like a bib and a pacifier when you're done, too. Fuck that. I want to taste that shit. So anyway, Solange, Prost, cheers. Pretty good. Pretty good. I'm not a cocktail guy. I don't really go for them much. They're okay. When I do do a cocktail, I want them simple. I want to be able to taste the. I want to be able to taste it. So this brings me to the real meat and potatoes of the video, which really isn't this. Everyone's had an old fashioned. Jesus, they're fucking basic. Just like the basic margarita, very classic. I have this. I guess uh, it's kind of like. The more American version. So let's talk about a new show on Netflix called Mix Master or Drink Master or Bader, whatever. On this show, you got these individuals that refer to themselves as <clears throat> here for this mixologists. Back in my day, we call them bartenders. You know what I'm talking about? Or Mac. <laughs> mixologist that's funny that's just a fancy way of saying i'll get you drunk so on the show and i was watching it for entertainment purposes on the show they're beginning with a margarita this is a very basic drink very basic and they're doing these weird concoctions 90 minutes hour and a half to make one cocktail present to the judges hour and a half you're gonna go into a place and order something that's gonna take you an hour and a half guaranteed it's gonna cost you like 20 30 bucks because it looks fun say fuck that give me some tequila some lime call it a day or gucci uh, i'm not gonna get into it too deep because it'll take pretty much a whole fucking time but uh the one i really wanted to point out was this one that um this lady deconstructed it was a margarita deconstructed, she called it, with a slice of uh, watermelon. How th is that a margarita? I don't know. I guess they make watermelon ritas, strawberry ritas, and all that, but a margarita is lime. Come on now. Don't fuck with it. And so this deconstructed cocktail consisted of her serving you a shot of tequila, a shot of lime juice, and this fried watermelon slice. It's like... So you're going to charge me more money for me to do your job and drink it too? Like, Jesus. Just let me make my own at that rate. Ridiculous. Not to mention all the um, flamboyancy going on in there. There was one chick in there that was definitely, definitely a volleyball coach, if you can't my meaning. But, you know, that's fine. You know, if that's what they're into, that's fine. But my, my point is... Why does that got to have anything to do with you making drinks? 
couple individuals on the show that were definitely of the alphabet side of town made a point to make sure you knew about it. It's like, dude, I don't care who you are. You make me a good drink. While I'm sitting on across from you on the bar, we're buddies. You're making me a good drink, I'll sit here and buy drinks, no problem. But I don't want to hear about that part of your life. Bruh. Just like I'm sure they wouldn't want to hear about my part of my life. You know what I mean? I'm there to buy drinks. That's it. They, they don't need to hear about that. Long story short, the show's ridiculous. It's just more wokeism crap. But anyway, I'm going to sit out here and I'm going to enjoy this old fashioned, very simple cocktail, very easy to drink. A little on the acidic side, so those of you with uh, sensitive tummies may want to avoid drinking too many of them. Obvious reasons. But that's that. So I hope you guys enjoyed the old fashioned and my quick little rant about the. Uh, mixology <laughs> going on in netflix check it out definitely check it out it's worth laughing at because like i said some of these concoctions are absolutely ridiculous the one dude serving dry ice in his margarita it's like maybe go ahead and put the dry ice in it but filter it out into a glass you know what i mean maybe that'd be kind of cool because give it to like that you know the steam or condensation whatever the fuck it is coming off it kind of rad but you know definitely check it out it's it's fun to laugh about watch an episode or two it's not something i'm gonna actually watch the rest of because i just find it ridiculous and hokey uh, but anyway that's that's that hope you guys are enjoying this uncommonly beautiful day here in november um catch you guys in the next one thanks for watching